I have an old HP Chromebook. It says, cannot upgrade the version anymore. It's got an old processor, but it still works fine. How do I get the Chromebook to boot to a USB? Is it still usable, but just can't upgrade? Unfortunately, at some point in time, all Chromebooks make it to what's called end of life. And end of life means that Google are no longer going to support that particular device. Google have been criticized for the short period of time with which they support devices. And that if a Chromebook stops receiving security updates, that makes the device vulnerable after maybe as short as just five years from that device finishing its production run. I don't have a great solution or pointers for that. It's unfortunately one of the things that has made Google receive criticism and I would say probably a slower uptake to Chromebooks and Chrome devices than they would have liked. Google's made this decision because it's difficult to support older machines and make sure things still work and make sure that the new security updates and the new features that you're rolling out will go out to those older machines. It's just what they do. Now, can you flash a Chromebook and specifically an older Chromebook with a newer copy of a different operating system? I have been asked on the channel, can you flash it with Chrome OS? I don't know that one for sure. I uh, may as well ask that one. Yes, you can install Chrome OS Flex, but it might not be supported by Google, especially those with the automatic expiration. Okay, so in this case, it looks like it's not gonna, um, it's probably not gonna solve this one, unfortunately, for this person. And you may also have driver issues. Okay, well, that doesn't help at all. Okay, anyway, but if you've got an older machine, I would say all you can really do is use it, but maybe not for anything that's super sensitive. I probably wouldn't use it for your crypto or for your banking, just in case there's some kind of security vulnerability that means that the machine is uh, subject to attack. If you wanna use it for a media center and plug it into your TV, okay, it's probably okay for that. If you wanna use it for your kids to watch YouTube on, okay, it's probably fine for that. Or someone to, do, I don't know, play some online games or video calls with grandma or using Google Meet. Using services that are inherently encrypted and not likely to be exposing your personal information, that's probably okay. What I use it for all of my emails, logged in on the couch and sign in with my Google account, maybe not after it's been many years after the security updates, but that's it. There are not many vulnerabilities for Chrome devices in general. These days, still, most times that people get hacked is because they clicked on a bad link and they voluntarily put their information in to a dodgy website or in some other way they were socially engineered. So I would say it's fairly low risk, even though it might not be perfect practice to use an old machine that doesn't have updates, it's still fairly low risk. If you liked this video, we've got plenty more on the channel covering this topic and much, much more.